Y'all, it looks like Cassie Ventura ain't done with Diddy yet as she reacts to Diddy's family defending him despite allegations against the disgraced mogul. Well, I guess the saying that birds of the same feather flock together is true for Diddy's family. Cause why in the world would you defend someone who's been accused of serious crimes? Because he's family. So Douglas Wigdor, Cassie's lawyer, has pointed out something that has been quite obvious to everyone. I mean, Douglas Wigdor has spoken on the fact that while Diddy wants a gag order and wants to control what his victims have to say, he seems to be okay with whatever his children have to say and do. Y'all, Diddy seems to be satisfied with his children going all out to defend him and make his own side of the story to be heard. Now this is where this whole drama becomes really interesting. So Cassie's legal team has frowned at Diddy's gag order and requests to stop potential witnesses and their attorneys from speaking publicly following an interview with a witness after his appearance before the grand jury. And it has become a concern to many who believe that Diddy might be trying his best to silence his accusers in order to avoid imprisonment. But even more troubling is the fact that Diddy's mom and his own children are defending him. And it's understandable that they're doing so because he's family to them, regardless of his alleged crimes. Now, for instance, a post on social media involving a joint statement that was released through Combs' legal team had Quincy Brown, Justin, Christian King, Chance, and twins Jesse and Delilah Combs say they've been devastated since the arrest of Combs. According to Combs' kids, many have judged Combs based on accusations, conspiracy theories, and false narratives that have spiraled into absurdity on social media. Also, adding that they're supporting Combs every step of the way. Y'all talk about some PR jobs being done by Combs kids. But that's not even all, as Janice, Combs' mother, has also come to her son's defense amid his legal troubles. Anyways, Cassie's lawyer, Douglas Wigdor, has criticized both Combs' gag orders and his family defense as being hypocritical. According to him, while Diddy seeks to silence witnesses and victims, his own family members have been loud and defensive about him. Now, in a statement issued in court on November 1st, Wigdor pointed out the inconsistency in the statement posted by Diddy sons who said the truth will prevail. Well, it seems like even Diddy's family might have been in the dark over Diddy's alleged crimes, and this is why I say so. Y'all, think about it. Do you think Diddy would bring his mom or his kids to his parties behind closed doors where he'd have his victims and high-profile partners perform some freak offs? I mean, he'd definitely not do anything like that. And that's why I can boldly say there are many things about Diddy's life that are obviously kept private and secret from his family. Moving on, Diddy remains in detention awaiting his May trial after being denied bail by two judges. Also, he has pleaded not guilty to the charges and has denied multiple claims of SA outlined in at least 18 civil SA lawsuits filed against him this November. Well, it's obvious that more and more allegations keep popping up against Diddy apart from Cassie's lawsuit, and this is why it's kinda annoying that Diddy's family are still defending him in the midst of this whole mess.